It is several weeks since Nigerians across the country have been faced with fuel shortage. Now, here in Lagos, long queues are still very visible as motorists and residents along a lagbury axis of the state call for a fast solution to the problem. Now, Plus TV News monitor the situation in Broadback in update. It hasn't been easy um, appertaining to the first scarcity. Um, the situation is very protective for we, the end users. It hasn't been easy getting fuel from the each filling stations. We we'll go, we we'll go to different filling stations, and um, it's very, very hard for us to get first fuel. They should release the fuel wherever they are holding. They should release it to cause it is making transport fuel high. It's making people stranded on the road. Bus we supposed to get fuel to carry people. They don't get. They don't get. With, they don't get fuel to carry people. So people are plenty in the bus stop. Some people used to sell the fuel two hundred. Per liter. So we used to sell the fuel 170, uh, that's 170 for the fuel. But to get the fuel is not easy. It's too stressful. This is my four, uh, second time of buying fuel in this total village of They are shitting people. This is Corolla, which everybody knows. They call it Almighty Corolla. Whenever you are using Corolla, you must know the fuel that will fill your tank to the, to the beam. If I want to film that from quarter downward, the total fuel that I used to buy is 6,000 naira. Oh no, okay. On half tank, I came in to go and just top up my fuel. At, at least I was thinking maybe 3,000 or 25. On getting here, they were selling 4,000. That's in fuel. I said, sir, where are you selling it to? 4,000 naira. That... Stop. He has to stop. And I went to go and meet the manager that what they saw for me here is not accurate. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.